In this problem, we will be seeing how to draw the projections of a cone whose axis is parallel to both HP and VP. So here the question is, draw the projections of a cone with 40 mm diameter and axis 50 mm long with axis parallel to both HP and VP. So first I will draw the pictorial representation of the position of this solid or cone. So the cone is lying with axis parallel to both HP and VP. It will be like this. Okay. So uh, like if you look from the front, that is the front view will be a triangle. And if you look from the top, the top view will be also a triangle. But if you look from the side, it will be projected onto a plane called profile plane. You will get a circle and that is of the true shape also. So let us start by drawing uh, the projection on the profile plane. So let's draw the circle with uh, diameter 40 mm. Now we have XY line and also a line perpendicular to that. Now I'm going to divide this circle in into eight equal parts. So one diameter at 90 degree, another diameter, then draw a line at 45 degree this side and then the line at 45 degree that side. So now we have divided the circle into eight equal parts. Let us name it as A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H. And I'm marking the apex as point O and all these points will be on the circle. Now, since this is a side view, I'm putting double dash to all these alphabets A to H. So in this problem, we can draw the front view that is a triangle from this side view. So let us start by transferring the point A onto this triangle. So it will be like uh, A and E dashed. I'm projecting onto this edge. Okay, it will be a triangle, right? That edge, all these points, A dash, B dash, everything will come on this vertical line. So here A dash can be seen, E dash will be hidden. Now I'm transferring point B dash and D dash. B dashed and d dashed okay next we'll uh, project from c double dashed that will be c dashed and project from h double dash and f double dash h dash will be seen and f dash will be hidden then projecting from g double dash to get g dashed now we know uh, on the middle line lies this uh, apex and so I'm drawing this edge dark, then also I'm marking the diameter of this circle that is 40 mm. It is very important to mark the dimensions. Next, I'm drawing the axis. We know the length of the axis is 50 mm, so I'm dimensioning that to 50 mm, sorry. It should be like this. Okay, right on top of the dimension line. Now. Since we have got the point O, join these two to get the triangle. Now I am drawing the generators also. Now this uh, front view is complete. So this is side view and this is front view. Now let us go on to draw the top view. In order to draw the top view, we need to transfer each point like this. So project uh, A double dashed onto the XY line and draw a line with 40 de 45 degrees or draw an arc with that corner as center. Now if you draw the projection line from A dashed, what we get will be the point A. Next like that, let us draw from H dashed and B dashed and draw a line at 45 degree and then project it like this. So here we will be getting H and B. Similarly, transfer G dashed and C double dashed 45 degree line, extend it. Uh, we need not draw horizontal lines fully because it will not be horizontal. Okay, now G and C also we got. Similarly, uh, draw projectors from F double dashed and D double dashed and we get F dashed, uh, sorry F and D. Similarly, from point E double dashed, also you are going to get the point E. All these lines should be at 45 degrees. Okay. Either 45 degrees or draw an arc. 
with that uh, midpoint joint point as center now extend this line and project point o also now i'm darkening the uh, front view sorry the top view so this is the top view